heart disease is the leading cause of death in the U.S. And earlier this week, Glendale Mayor Jerry Wires suffered a heart attack and thankfully is recovering after un undergoing quintuple bypass surgery. The mayor spoke with Team 12's Josh Sanders from his hospital bed, giving us an update on his recovery. I'm really thankful to the you know, to be here and be alive. And Last weekend, Glendale Mayor Jerry Wires knew something was off. I uh, was trying to figure out uh, what happened to some of these issues because it's been raining, you know, the, the joint aches. Uh, was it uh, COVID-19? It was finding myself short on breath and kind of felt like a sort of tennis ball. What the mayor didn't know was he was having a heart attack, his wife rushing him to urgent care Thursday, undergoing quintuple bypass surgery. When you have a, a quintuple bypass, it's actually five arteries that are blocked, and we need to bypass it to provide an area of the heart with blood circulation that it was lacking. Heart disease is the number one killer in the U.S., but not everyone having a heart attack knows it. I had no warning whatsoever. He's starting to one one. What's the location? Weeks before Christmas, 65-year-old Dennis Lamb in Tucson collapsed in his backyard after going into cardiac arrest. His life saved by CPR. The CDC says one in five are silent. Just a day after surgery, Mayor Wires is now back on his feet, thankful for his wife and medical team, and ready to get back to work. They already had me up and walking down the hallway today. Took a beating out of me, but I know that if I listen to him, I'll be able to get back to work quicker. So that's what I'm doing. The CDC reports every 36 seconds someone dies from cardiovascular disease and that diet and exercise can help in reducing heart disease and that CPR saves lives. We're in downtown Phoenix, Josh Sanders, 12 News.